Um, actually, I had some problems uploading this with Jing, um, so I'm going to go ahead and upload it with the expression instead. So, here we go. Hey everybody, this is Brian. Just um, showing another way you can upload your stuff besides using Jing, uh, in case you don't want to use Jing. Um, what I like to use is Microsoft Expression Encoder. Um, it's a free download from Microsoft. Uh, there's actually a better version available uh, with the MSDNAA. Um, basically all you do is you, you open this up, gives you a little encoder here. Uh, hit record. Um, it's going to ask you to select which area you want to record in. Um, and we're going to just do this whole section right here. Um, and basically you, know, you take whatever screenshot you want to do. Uh, first you open up, open up uh, let's say, uh, I don't know, uh, let's say we wanted to go to, let's say I'm on Blackboard here and I'm Let's pull this over. Just kind of recording whatever I want to see here. So I go through and find what I want to record. Hit record. It just starts showing up like this. And move around a little bit. It's good enough, I guess. Um, once I'm finished, there's a, uh, I have a dual screen here on the other screen. You can see a stop button. Goes ahead and finishes it up. And at that point, uh, just open and send it to the encoder real quick. What's good about this is it kind of gives you different ways you encode it, including uh, MP4, um, which I believe is a, a paid option on the uh, Jing uh, program. So, just loads up right there. Actually, you know, well, actually, it is a paid version on here, although we do have the paid version for free. But in this case, we're just going to do it under Windows uh, Media. Um, so there it is. I'm just going to go ahead and unfortunately the Jing guy here this looks like he is interfering with my screen. So let's reduce it some there. All right. So once we have what we need, we just encode it. It's just a short little piece, so it's going to go pretty quickly. On um, that point, just turn that off. You can open up our uh, Microsoft um, Live Movie Maker, which is another free service uh, for Microsoft. Um, you can just go through, add video. Uh, let's see, we have this saved under... There we go, expression. Encoder, output, look for today's date, which let's see, today is, there we go. Let's go ahead and add that in there. There are a short little video, it's all loaded, ready to go. What's pretty cool is you can send this to a lot of different places. You can send it to Facebook, YouTube, SkyDrive, Sky all these different places. So if I just want to go to YouTube, um, it's going to go ahead and ask me what resolution to send it to. I'll just pick the very basic one to speed things up. You go ahead and log into your YouTube account. Just filling some basic stuff. Um, I'll just put in here short, short, just to upload it real quick. Uh, let's see, comedy, let's say. I'm going to make it private. Hit publish. And bada bing. Bada boom, and it's online. So, um, pretty easy to do. Of course, I have, that, I have a couple of different logins. It's a different login, so I can't see one there until I log into it. But you kind of get the gist. Um, just an alternative to Jing. Um, Jing definitely looks a lot easier. Personally, yeah, I don't know. You know, never heard it before. So, um, I'm not sure if I trust my information putting up there, especially with uh, third parties. So, thank you again.